Welcome to DPV Technology. In this tutorial, we will see what is PIR sensor. A PIR sensor or passive infrared sensor allows to sense motion. They are almost always used to detect whether a human has moved in or out of the sensor range. PIRs are basically made of pyroelectric sensor which can detect levels of infrared radiation. Every object emit heat energy in the form of radiation. For a human, heat is radiated as infrared. This radiation is not visible by naked eye, but this radiation can be detected by the PIR sensor. The white color lines in the PIR sensor are used to focus the IR rays to the center of the sensor. This lens is called Fresnel lens. The PIR sensor has two slots in it. One is this one and another one is this one. Each slot is made of a special material that is sensitive to infrared. When the sensor is idle, both slots detect the same amount of infrared. When a warm body like human or animal passes by, it first intercepts one half of the PIR sensor, which causes a positive differential sense between the two slots. When the warm body leaves the sensing area, the reverse happens. That is, it generates a negative differential sense. These sense pulses are detected and thus the sensor came to know when an object comes into the area of working. The module has three pin. This one is PCC, then output pin, and then ground pin. It has two potentiometer, one for adjusting the sensitivity of the sensor and another one for adjusting the delay time. Output becomes high when an object is detected and the output remains high depending upon the delay time you have set. Output becomes low as soon as the delay time is over. The sensor has another three pins with a jumper connected over to pins. It is used for selecting the trigger mode. One is called repeatable trigger and another one is called non-repeatable trigger. When the sensor is in non-repeatable trigger, sensor output becomes low from high when the delay time is over. In case of repeatable trigger, the sensor output becomes high until the detected object is in the range of the sensor. 